Well, I, I, I well, thank you, and, and I do want to actually comment um, on on Tom and how important it is for us it, right now to have a leader like Tom in Sacramento, uh, because as many of you know, the temptation to not have a balanced approach, the temptation to not put kids first, the temptation to get very ideological on a lot of the issues facing our kids and facing our schools is strong and comes with a lot of money behind it. Sometimes a million dollars from a neighbor from a mayor in New York. Or or or, 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 or others. And Tom has listened. He's been a coalition builder. He's refused to um, go, you know, he's, he's, he's refused to take up arms in the educational wars that are really not about kids and really kept us focused. And these last four years have been the worst four years that we ever could have imagined. Amen. And Tom has led us and guided us with, you know, uh, a, a quiet strength and a kids first leadership. And I can't wait for him to be able to lead us in not a time of famine. And um, it is, it really is, as he takes a bite of pizza. <laughs> it, it, but, but don't, I, 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 I can speak from experience. Don't underestimate how strong the forces are against someone who, who has a balanced kids first approach that attempts to include everyone and be collaborative. And those of us who believe in that, those of us who live by the idea that it has to be all of us together making change for our kids, all of us together making change for our kids, need to have Tom's back. And um, so I was supposed to talk about technology, I just gave this to you, Mike Woodward, but I will say that um, in, in order to reduce all of the gaps that face our kids with the most need, whether it's the school readiness gap, whether it's the technology gap, whether it's the whether it's the instructional gap, whether it's the opportunity gap, the achievement gap doesn't happen by accident. And Tom understands that. And Tom wants to make sure that whether it's technology, whether it's early childhood education, what whatever whatever it is, that's my alarm to stop talking. Thank you. <laughs> it, it is it is something that in partnership we're going to make sure that all kids have access to. And that's. Um, you know, that is, we can't do that without the state. We can try, but really, as, we, as we've seen, if we don't have a partner fighting with us for our kids, none of it's going to happen. So, I'm, really Thank you, I'm proud to stand with you, Tom. Thank I you hope, very much. I hope, I hope all, all people who care about kids in California will.